Hello everybody! Today we came up with five great ideas of how to use cans in everyday life. Uh, we love the idea of recycling, but one day I just looked at the cans and thought, hmm, why not to make something interesting out of them? Cans have very cool texture, they have very beautiful colors, some of them have very unusual labels, so I thought, why not to play around with them? Because cans, you just can't go wrong with cans. If nothing works, you can just recycle them. So these are some cans that I used for this project. This one is very plain and basic can, but I squeezed it a little bit, so it got this curve and some attitude to it. I love it like this. Uh, so play around with your cans. Another type of basic can is this ripped can. I guess pretty much all canned goods come in cans like this, so you take off the lid, take off the label, wash it carefully, and you may use it in pretty much all uh, projects that you will see in this video. Another type of can which I love is can with cool label on it. This can is from Heinz tomato paste and you can put some salt and pepper inside, especially if cans have some Cyrillic letters or some uh, hieroglyphics on, on them. Try to play around with them, try to be creative. I guess they will look uh, unusual and special on your table or wherever you put it. Another type of cans is giant cans. This one is copper. They're very hard to get and once you get them, don't throw them away. They're cool and special. <laughs> most obvious way to use a can is to use it as a vase with some rustic um, flowers, with some rustic bouquet, it will look very kinfolk-esque. <laughs> so I put it near so you will um, see how cool it looks on your table or maybe in some restaurant which serves cool food. <laughs> Another way to use a can is to use it as a candle. I didn't make a video of how I did it because I guess it's very easy and simple to just pour wax inside and put a wick inside. I suggest putting wooden wick. This way the candle would look more expensive and nicer. You can light it at, uh, on the street or at home. This looks very unusual. <laughs> I'm not sure if cans are good for plants, but if you are ready to change your plants or uh, you are ready to experiment, put your plants inside a can and uh, play around with it, put some stones or sand on top, it will look very fresh and cool. <laughs> If you're having a garage party or a bee party, try to put your uh, snacks into cans. They will look very cool and, you know, quirky. So I put peanuts and popcorn inside these cans and I think it looks fantastic. I think uh, it's all in different textures. So peanuts have this texture and popcorn has this fluffy texture. It looks very cool in metal mold. <laughs> Indie restaurants uh, pay attention on DIY things, so uh, I found out that a lot of restaurants try to put cutlery inside cans, and this looks very cool. It's very, very usual, it's very easy to make, so try to do it if you have some party or maybe if you run a restaurant or a pub. I think this looks uh, great and it's very easy to put together. Play around with it again, put inside some cool napkins, some cool cutlery. Don't stick to the projects that we showed. Try to experiment, try to experiment with textures, with colors, just play around with it. Thank you very much for watching.